Another demonstration taking place on the McBride Viaduct this morning. Jet 24's Krista Nielsen tells us the next step for the movement trying to save that bridge. I drove a car. I drove a truck. As the debate continues over the demolition of the McBride Viaduct, local songwriters are lending a creative hand. Protesters gathered on the bridge to sing songs, both original and covers, adapted to be about the bridge, its past, and its uncertain future. Local musician and songwriter St. Stephen led most of the sing-alongs. I actually wrote a song called East Avenue uh, 35 years ago. Now he's rewritten several popular songs to be about saving the McBride Viaduct. It just started coming out. You know, all these songs are cover tunes, but the words lend themselves to the cause. He remembers how vital this passage was for him when he lived on Erie's east side. Take your east Avenue bridge. Julie von Volkenberg is another musician and songwriter lending her voice to the issue. The idea came about um, just in talking about how can we promote this idea of saving the viaduct for pedestrians and cyclists and kids. The debate over this bridge has gone on for a long time, but the focus is now changing to Mayor-elect Joe Schember, asking him for a public hearing once he takes office. It's so safe. Um, I mean, it could be made safer, of course, with a little bit of funding, but uh, as of right now, I mean, you don't have to worry about cars and trucks like you do on the highway, which is would be the alternative. Seeing kids jump across four lanes, it, you're, it's going to keep happening. If this is eliminated, it'll happen all the time. A cosmic ride! Fire! Kristen Nielsen, Jet 24 Action News.